you look around this house, you see uh, Troy Lyons, John Wayne, and a lot of family. Some people get married, have kids. I've never been married. My passion is Troy Lyons, football. But like I told one lady, I said, apparently, you're not as loved as the Duke and the Lions. So you got to pick up your game a little bit, sweetheart. If you want to hang around the Crackyola Hotel. My name is Ron Crackyola, a.k.a. Crackman. I grew up in uh, Utica, Michigan, a little farming community back then. We, my dad bought there in 57. You know, I'd go with my dad to the games at Tiger Stadium, and it was just awesome. The, the crowd, you know, and the, and the center field, you know, you had the diehard fans there. And, you know, my dad knew people, and after the game, a lot of players would go over across the street to Hoot Robinson's, and, you know, you get some autographs, and you meet the guys, and it was just a, it was a lot of fun. And it loved outside, the cold weather. It's part of me, you know, I think, I think probably when I was born, out of my mother's womb, it was like, go Lions, baby! You know, die hard. Been season ticket holder for 40 years. You know, my dad had him, then I, I took him over. Now, my dad don't go anymore with me. He says, I'm out of control. The last game he was at, I got all, it was a touchdown. I stood up and my arm went flying, almost knocked him over. He said, that's it, kid. You're out of control. I'm done with this, you know. I'll watch it at home on the TV. Stand up. I had a lot of great memories in the Silver Dome. A lot of, a lot of good times there. You know, the Silver Dome was unique the way that because of the parking around the stadium. You know, so you all was all together, all one, one body. You know, it was a lot of, a lot of fun. I never quit supporting them, watching them on the road. Very proud. I started going to Chicago when I first started going to road games. Probably in the early 80s. I used to belong to the quarterback club in uh, the Silver Dome. And we'd just have a group of us go, stay at the team hotel. We had a lot of fun. But of course, you get a lot of beer baths in Chicago. I mean, they just, I'm like, hey, you know, you can buy me one, I'll drink it. You don't gotta throw it on my back. You, you know, ugh, bear fans. <laughs> so then you gotta set the tone and they just leave you alone. I remember the first time in the dog pound, I go in there. And those fans are, I mean, they're rough. They're tough. You know, I, I'm dressed like this. And, Proud. I mean, wherever I go on the road, I'm, I'm proud. I don't care where I go, but I go walk in a dog pound, they're all <laughs> barking and they're throwing these dog biscuits at me, just boom, I'm getting pounded. So that's it. Try to pick a couple of them up and I start eating them. <laughs> Take that, you, you know, brownies. Holy Jesus, this guy, he's like, wow, you know, he's incredible. Probably the best road game I was at in a lot of years is in Green Bay. In 2015, we beat them, and I was with Donnie, and that was my, oh, off the hook. And we, we, we didn't leave the stadium. I had a picture of Donnie, we're hugging each other. But that was a great, I mean, winning in Green Bay is so fun watching all the Packer fans walking out. Well, oh, that's, that's awesome. PFUFA coin, that stands for charitable, fundraising, and fellowship with other fans. So I like when people come in, I like them to be welcome. You know, it's like anything else. You, you go to someone's house, a family reunion, they ain't gonna start throwing stuff at you. You, know, you, you. You're walking them home to your town. So they go back home and say, hey man, I don't, all this bad about Detroit. Great time, great city, great, you know, it's, uh, and that's what you do. Blue collar people, and that's what, that's what Detroit Lions are. Blue collar, the working man. That's, let's get up and go to work. You know, that's, that's what I love about the city of Detroit. And, I love about Detroit Lions, and I believe they're going to be successful and succeed, and they're going to be eye-openers. People are going to be, they're going to be shaking their head going like, wow, they're, they're the championship.